everybody, it's Sabrina and welcome back to my channel and today we're going to be doing 10 books that I think will teach you something in under 10 minutes. Let's get started. So I've compiled a list of books that I think will teach you something that will either help you or make you learn something. I think that is such a wonderful thing is to read a book and learn something from it or kind of be able to put it into your own life and use it. So here is a list of books that I think will teach you something and will better your life. The first book I have is Speak by Laurie Anderson. So this book follows a girl who was bullied in high school and she had something very traumatic happen to her which has made her kind of rethink everything she's ever seen before and something comes to light about her about midway through is dealing with kind of the aftermaths of that and the aftermath of everybody in high school resenting her because of the aftermath of that assault and what she did to kind of help her and what she felt like she had to do in that situation and not everybody knows what happened to her. This book will definitely teach you not to judge people and definitely teach you that everybody's going through something whether it's physical or not. This book was so inspiring and it's so incredibly amazing and I definitely thank it'll teach you something. The next book I have is The Wife Upstairs by Rachel Hawkins. So this book follows a girl who really, really, really just wants to have money. She walks dogs in this super rich neighborhood and because of this she meets this guy who seems perfect. His wife had been missing so she really thinks nothing of it until the end of the book where a twist definitely happens and this book will teach you don't trust everybody and don't think everybody's telling you the truth every time you meet them because some people do cover up their past. The next book I have is The Long Way Down by Jason Reynolds. This book follows a young boy who is dealing with the aftermath of a gang violence in his neighborhood against his brother. So on the way down the elevator he is met in every floor by all these people he knows who have been victims of gang violence. Now on the way down they all try to convince him is it worth it to get vengeance for his brother or should he go back upstairs and not continue this man's slaughter path. This book will definitely teach you hard decisions are worth making and doing what's best for you in the long run is what's most important. This book is absolutely stunning and I really think it'll teach you something. The next book I have is Dear Martin by Nick Stone. So this book follows a boy named Justin. Justice is an African American living in California and he is suffering the consequences of being racially profiled by a police officer. He has friends who have been murdered by the police and he's kind of dealing with all these issues around him and he's trying to make a different and make a change in his neighborhood. This book will definitely teach you not to judge people by the book of their cover. This book will definitely teach you to open your eyes a little bit more and have empathy for others and will definitely show you the other side of the perspective when it comes to race. This book was absolutely incredible and I really think it'll teach you something. The next book I have is Fangirl by Rainbow Rowell. This book follows a girl who's going to college with her twin sister and her twin sister isn't really into the whole fangirling thing like she is Sue anymore and this has taken a really big toll on her and because of that she's kind of starting to question her entire college career because she just doesn't know where she fits in. Now she meets a lot of people along the way who definitely support her decision to keep writing fan fiction and be a fangirl and this book will definitely teach you to continue to be who you are and not to be shameful in who you are and what you love to do and be more like Kath and be more like Kath and love what you do and not feel any shame in that. The next book I have is Jackie Ha Ha by James Patterson. This book follows a young girl who grows up to be a comedian and all of the struggles and turmoils she had to go through to get there. This book will definitely teach you no matter where you came from you can definitely excel and be bigger than who you ever thought you would be. The next book I have is The Night Swim by Megan Golden. So this book follows a girl who runs a podcast and it's dual perspective with letters and this girl is trying to cover a murder story when she gets dragged into a murder story of a girl whose sister was murdered but the cops covered it up and this book will definitely teach you to continue to stand up for what you believe in and never back down. The next book I have is Everything Everything by Nicola Yoon. This book is about a girl with a disorder where she is allergic to everything so she has to stay inside her house at all times or she is at really high risk of getting sick. Now she decides to leave her house and live outside of this bubble. This book is absolutely incredible. I love all the little details with the notes and things like that and this book will definitely teach you sometimes it's okay to live out of your bubble and get that experience versus living in the same situation or the same life you've always been in. The next book I have is The Outsiders by S.E. Hinton. This book is about a boy in the 60s who is caught in a little bit of a scuffle and he ends up killing a boy so they go and they have to hide out and this book will definitely teach you that family is more than blood. Family is your community and you should always have people you can count on in a moment's need. 
And the very last book I have is The Takedown by Corey Wong. This book is about a girl who gets a very scandalous video sent out of her and her high school teacher and she is a valedictorian and her life starts to crumble because she does not know who took this video. Now this book is set really far into the future where there is face recognition and things like that on the internet so you really can't escape a video like this which is super sad for her. This book will definitely teach you what's on the internet, stays on the internet forever and to definitely watch what you put out there. And now that is going to be my 10 books in under 10 minutes that I think will teach you something. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did make sure you give it a super big like, a super big comment, and subscribe to my channel for more videos like this. I upload every Monday and Thursday at 11.45 a.m. Eastern Time and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye!